fire and water signs. Fire is the creative and water is the emotions, relations, connection, romantic and vibrant, heartless ways, feelings to people in your life, intuition over logic, decisions with your heart over your head. And then you know fire signs creative pseudo wands pseudo cup oh lord you got the three of cups Celebrate squad party accomplishments. Yeah, she said I've been sitting in this position too long. Uh, gotta go to sleep after this. Other people's decision don't influence yours. So you could be trying to buckle down and or you could be planning to planning to do things and people want to put their input in or try to say, I'll let me help you or whatever, we could do it together. I feel like especially if you've cut these people off from past situations, there's no need to bring them into your new situation just because you feel like you need people. You've been doing this stuff by yourself for a long time and when you include people into your business, they try try to find ways or they do find ways to to manip like to mess up your plans to cause problems and blockages so that you don't enjoy yourself <sighs> past you might pass on somebody awful or the test that you've been put through you passed just by answering a question you've passed but when it comes down to being put through that actual test, people are going to try to come in to manipulate you. That's why they're saying, okay, she finna go through a test. What type of test is she going through? Okay, let's put up these blockages so she get distracted. So when it comes time to it, she'll be so in her emotions that she'll think that, okay. So maybe they'll even put up fake tests that you're think you communicating with your spirit guides and angels and telling them like okay i comprehend what it is that i'm supposed to be doing but they will only contact you once they won't contact you again to see if you understand what's going on because as they're explaining it to you they know what you're thinking so they you know have your answer but when they put you through the test are you really going to do what you say and the comics don't like that you actually do what you say so they're going to try to influence you make you think that this is a test so that you give the response that they've influenced you to give and then they're going to expose you so now the guardian angels are saying well why are you so thirsty to expose her we didn't ask for your input or your two cents so now they see that as um them trying to say like don't put her through the test because this is her answer but they've probably been passing themselves off as workers because they've been using divine feminine energy but showing what divine feminine you know but it's like i thought that we was gonna do the test at this like did i admit like you know just causing confusion it's like I was supposed to be there. I thought that it was at this time. And now you got a guardian angel all up in their head. And they can't protect Divine Feminine. Because now they feel like they missed their mission. Oh, I'm thirsty. Even when your faith was tested. You got lied on, cheated, and mistreated. You still stood 10 toes. You still defended yourself and you still did what you were called to do. It's just that you were a little aggy. No, not being aggy, but you were agitated that that's 
the energy that somebody that you work so hard for and been so loyal to would would you know but but they're saying like i had to put you through it to see because i wasn't sure anymore <sighs> spoiled personality new location pregnant a bond and that's whatever type of bond fits into your situation Hey. <sighs> a friendship. So y'all could be building a bond on like first base. <laughs> uh, good things are coming. Because it's like you're genuinely trying and you're not trying to uh, use any tactics to try to manipulate somebody to be in, in your life. You will have success. Whether you be spoiling yourself. They said we we use you because we know you're gonna pass the test because we taught you well and we got faith that you um not gonna switch up because you know you like it over here. You not like even though you've gotten a taste of the other side, it's like I'd rather be on this side and this side is harder to be on, so or not even that, it's just how you comprehend stuff because um by it being a dark worker you saying that it's easier to be on that side but then you try to go on that side and you feel like dang this is harder than that side and then vice versa big mad that they couldn't turn you evil Or basically make you fit the profile because now it's backfiring on them, exposing them for being the little thotteratis. Because the people that they recruited, they're dealing with stuff and they're not as strong in these karmics that they have hearts still. And it's like, I got a life and I'm not trying to have that be messed up because I went into partnership with this person. So I'm going to expose them and, you know, they probably do it anonymously. And you don't always have to look for something. You might find exactly what you need when you're not even looking for it. Ain't that how it always is? You be looking for something, and then when you ain't looking for it no more, you find it. <laughs> Divine Masculine didn't trust the process. Or actually, it's not about them. It's about manifesting for yourself. So trust the process. That what is for you will be for you. This is an earth sign. <sighs> yeah. Um, this earth sign is not stopping because they feel like this is what you deserve, especially after all the time and efforts you put into trying to get them to realize that they were headed in the wrong direction. <sighs> you got the eight of pentacles, if you guys know what that is. <sighs> 